Global pressure may have led Russia to sign grain deal with Ukraine, top State Department official says a top State Department official said that pressure from the global community and Russia's need for money from its own agricultural exports may have led Moscow to sign an agreement to allow Ukrainian grain to transit through the Black Sea. This came together because, I think, Russia ultimately felt the hot breath of global opprobrium, said Victoria Noland, Under Secretary of State for Political Affairs. It is now incumbent on Russia to actually implement this deal, she told CNN hours after the deal was signed in Istanbul. The agreement, which took weeks of negotiations, is very well structured in terms of monitoring and in terms of, you know, channels that the grain ought to be able to get out of, she said at the Aspen Security Forum Friday. Nuland noted that, it should have been easy, you know, we could have done this on the back of an envelope in the middle of an afternoon with Will. But Russia's blockade made this not only a European crisis, but obviously a global crisis in terms of food security, she added. Russia also was out there complaining to the world that its own fertilizer and grain couldn't get out, Nuland also said, noting that US sanctions did not block the export of those products, but their agreement to Friday's deal may also have had to do with the fact that it was hard for them to get shippers and insurers and others to move their grain so they also need the money, given what else we're doing to them.